time, it's here. The heat is here, which means many people are probably ready to go take a dip. And if you're headed to a nearby public pool, you'll need the lifesavers in red. But as THV 11's Mercedes McKay shows us, staffing those lifeguard stands could be an issue. It seems like we've told this story many times before. It's just a different industry struggling to get workers. It's not just here in Arkansas, though. It's a nationwide issue. The people that are supposed to be here protecting you while you're swimming in the pool are tough to find. This is pretty bad. We don't typically see this kind of shortage. This year, it's really kind of been kind of scarce. It's an issue that stretches from state water parks. We are probably at about 50% of the number of lifeguards that we need in the park right now. To neighborhood pools. For all four facilities, we need probably around 35, 36. That's including management, and right now we're functioning on 24. That number is still enough for the city of Sherwood to run all their pools, but it means aquatics coordinator Kelly Lewis may have to get back up on the lifeguard stand. When someone calls in sick or vacations come up, I'm actually in the rotation and managing at the same time. It's something Lewis has never experienced before, but says the normality of masks and social distancing distancing may play a role. I think a lot of people are, are scarce of it and being that close to to the public. Magic Springs sales and marketing director Michelle Keeney believes the pandemic is the reason for the shortage, but in a different way. These young individuals weren't able to participate in any um, activities last summer, so they may be taking advantage of every extracurricular activity that they can take advantage of this year. With only half the lifeguards they need to fully operate, Keeney says they may have to pick and choose what parts of the park are open when. We may not have a pool or a slide open for a part of the day. We may have to open one a few hours and then switch to another one. By increasing pay and other incentives, Keeney is hopeful more workers will jump in. Mercedes McKay, THV 11 News. If you think you're the type to don the red bathing suit or swim trunks, there's a job fair at Magic Springs for lifeguards on Tuesday and Wednesday next week from 4 to 6 p.m. Head to THV11.com for all the details on how and where to apply for all of those open positions.